Hi, you guys. I'm Dorothy from Vivian Tech. If you are modification in the UVS of remote control transport vehicles and good at DIY and transform various new functions by yourself, then this remote control tank robot chassis will be your dream car. Next, let me introduce more to you. First of all, the entire chassis's external contours and lines have been professionally designed. The chassis is a rubber track, which is not only simple and stylish, but also has a very strong load-bearing capacity, with a maximum load of 300 kilograms. The MC7 remote control we selected as standard configuration can achieve stable and precise control. Customers can choose the FPV function as an option based on their needs, built-in camera and LED light, which are very useful during use. Users can observe the front view of the vehicle through the controller screen, which can better observe the surrounding terrain and meet the needs of night operations. In addition, our machines equipped with eight shock-absorbing springs, it provides excellent shock-absorbing capabilities. During the transportation process, it can reduce the risk of collisions during cargo transportation and reduce cargo damage. For optimal performance, we adopt the drive wheels to nylon wheels, which can reduce the weight of tracked vehicles, improve fuel efficiency, and reduce wear between wheels and tracks, greatly increasing service life. Nylon material has high resistance to corrosion from lubricants and various chemicals. It can ensure that our power system is safe and reliable even in harsh environments. Our frames are designed for strength, beauty, durability, and high expandability. The driving wheel, suspension wheel, and driven wheel are all made of nylon, ensuring a lightweight but strong and durable structure. Users can choose to buy our batteries. The battery capacity is 48V20R, which is ideal for long-term work. When DIY, users can also buy lithium batteries according to their needs. It is worth mentioning that Vigoran Servo Motor Controller is a servo control system offering superior performance compared to other drivers on the market. The dual-channel servo motor driver ensures excellent synchronization, enabling straight-line movement, which is challenging to achieve with other controller. Our company has designed a function expansion hub specifically for the use of the machine. It can be used in conjunction with our motor controller to achieve a variety of functional uses. It has seven remote control channels, for extended controllable channels and allows the addition of other function modules. On this basis, users can DIY on their own, innovate and change according to their actual needs and preferences, and customize the vehicle. We matched the power system of remote control lawnmower VTLM 800, which is very mature, not only of high quality but also of very long service life. The servo motor ensures high torque output, high temperature resistance and precise synchronization on both sides of the professional controller. It has the function of electronic braking on the ramp stop to prevent slipping. The worm gear reducer is a traditional transmission device consisting of a worm wheel and a worm with an involute tooth profile. At present, our reducer speed ratio is 30 to 1. If the customer needs a chassis with a faster travel speed, we can customize a reducer with a smaller reduction ratio so that the torque is reduced and the travel speed will be faster. Finally, our remote control tank robot chassis can be customized and configured according to customer needs to achieve the desired effect. Hello everyone! Welcome to our tutorial on how to use the remote control tank robot chassis. In the video, we will walk you through the operation in detail, from charging the battery to using the machine skillfully. Let's get started. First, make sure the battery is fully charged before using the machine. This is the charging port where you can plug it in and charge it. Next, before you start using it, turn on the power switch on the remote control, and then turn on the power switch on the machine. Now let's move this machine. By using the remote control, you can easily go forward, backward, 
Turn left. And turn right. It's very simple. This joystick controls the speed of the machine. You can switch between high and low speeds according to your needs. Use this joystick to set the cruise control. Finally, to turn off the machine, turn off the power button on the machine itself. And then turn off the power switch on the remote control. That's it. Now you can start using your chassis. Users can also choose our H12 remote control. Let's see how it works. First, turn on the remote control. This will take some time. Then turn on the power switch on the machine. Use this joystick to move forward, backward. And this one to turn left, turn right. Users can also choose our H12 remote control with FPV function. Finally, to turn off the machine, turn off the power button on the machine itself. And then turn off the power switch on the remote control. That's it. Thank you. What do you think after watching this introduction video? If you prefer to buy your own one, feel free to contact me. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.